Schneiderman. Does whatever a spider can. Look out. Here comes Schneiderman. Hello Saints fans, here I am with three of the greatest guys of the St Kilda Footy Club on their, their final Brownlow BNF night. Um, it's been a pretty emotional night and they're going to try it in my ears. So, Blakey, you've been to how many of these? 20? About 15 uh, of these? Just a couple. Just a couple. Yeah, uh, it's been a pretty emotional one for you, mate. Tell us how you've been tonight. Uh, look, I, was, I thought I was going to be okay, but then I, thought, I saw that my teammates um, just talk about me as a player and a teammate, and I got all emotional, and it was, uh, it was fantastic to watch, and um, you know, I'm just uh, just grateful to be part of this club. Beautiful. And Milne, mate, uh, you're one of the smartest guys I know when, uh, when it comes to holding yourself together, but you nearly lost it tonight, didn't you? Yeah, I did start, so there was a couple of times where I had to uh, have three or four seconds off and just pause for a bit, but I thought I had myself pretty good. Um, you know, when you're around a footy club for 12 or 13 years, you get to make a lot of great friends and friends for life and you know, I was lucky enough to um, get up tonight and make a you know okay speech and but it was pretty tough up there and I'm just pretty happy so that okay. I'm pretty it was a great speech. Um, <laughs> I'm pretty happy that Jackie Stephen won the Chipper Barker Award so um, tonight's about the Chipper Barker Award and um, congratulations to Jack you know you know the footy club's going places if uh, you know he's winning our uh, club champion award so well done Jack. Well, thank you. And uh, Cozzy, mate, you can bloody you can cry sneezing sometimes, and you held yourself well, well to get up there tonight. So tell us how your night's been. Oh, mate, I was cooked. I got up there and I saw the uh, saw the video and looked over to you boys and forgot everything I was going to say. And I hope it came across all right because I was shaking and nervous and shit. But, but it's a great night. It's been a great week for the club. It's great to uh, great to see Jack win tonight, Trevor Barker Award, and it's good to celebrate with the lads and go out. Beautiful. And just quickly for all the fans out there. Over your career, just give us one of your highlights of your career, funniest moments or something that you'll never forget at the footy club. Uh, one of the highlights will definitely be one of my last the last game with these boys. Uh, yeah, yeah, good. Um, embarrassing moment was probably a, a couple of weeks back. I may have uh, handled out of this goal square out to a point. Allegedly, I don't know. Um, uh, but uh, that's, yeah, that's me. So. Yeah, uh, many highlights, playing in finals wins. Lucky enough to play in um, uh, many of um, Robert Harvey's testimonial games, Stuart sure, Lowe's like 300s, um, and obviously the embarrassment uh, story of my 13 years was this year, 13 years in. I've got a, a lot, but to see my great mate over here, Richmond kick a point, and he grabs the ball to kick out from fullback and handballs it. That's never happened in, I don't know, 150 years of footy. Excuse me, I'm talking. Excuse me. Um, so, Jason Blake, well done, the first person to ever handball the ball out of fullback. What an idiot. Good <laughs> <laughs> old mud. Oh, mate, I just love, I love hanging around the boys, so a lot of footy trips. Um, when, we, when we got it all done and we went away and celebrated with the boys at the end of the year, that was a highlight. The, the boys have said them, but last, last Saturday, the last quarter, to come on and, and play with you guys and actually you know, enjoy it and enjoy the crowd and everyone getting up after after a, a year of a little bit of disappointment on field. So just be a part of that was amazing. And this whole week's been a little bit surreal, really. But um, yeah, it's all been good fun. Well, guys, just quickly again for the supporters out there, what's not, what's the plans for the rest of your life next year? So and so, what do you got planned? Uh, I'm going to be do a bit of uh, work in property uh, with Coles, but. Um, I'm not too sure. I think Milne wants to drag me to Bowie, the footy club to play, but we'll have to yeah, wait and see. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Thanks. Yeah, mate. A bit of family time the next uh, couple of months and, you know, spend some time with the kids and, you know, get away and take it easy. It's been a long year, so, um, you know, whatever happens after that will happen and, um, you know, I'll fall on or something. So, um, now looking forward to the next chapter of my life. Um, you know, I'm really happy with the decision I've made and, you know, can't wait to... Uh, sit back with these two legends and you know have a couple of beers and watch the mighty saints for many years to come well my immediate plan is not to go for a run for a very long time i'm not going to the gym or going for a run i'm just going to uh chill out over the summer go up the river and catch a few fish and um get on the dirt bike and have a muck around <laughs> well there you have it guys three of the greats of the club saying their farewell for the final time to the saints so thanks to your sport boys you've been true legends of the club Cheers. Well done. Yeah, well done. Well done, Swords. <laughs> Schneiderman. Does whatever a spider can. Look out. Here comes Schneiderman.